Since its compositions for Nier Automata and Final Fantasy XV's episode Gladiolus, Keiichi Okabe has quickly risen to being my favorite JRPG composer. The eerie beauty he creates in his pieces is unique, with his use of vocals and instrument combinations adding to this. I mentioned in one of my Nier posts that I heard Nier's music was brilliant, and Okabe's pieces in Automata certainly proved that to me. I know it's only the first half of the year, but so far there's no question that Nier Automata has the best JRPG soundtrack this year so far, and I'm pretty sure it's in my top favorite ones ever. Speaking of top fives, here are five of my favorite tracks from Nier Automata's brilliant soundtrack. This cannot continue is special to me for a couple of reasons. Firstly, it was playing the moment Nier Automata clicked with me. The scene leading into this track was so weird, in a good way, compared to anything I've played in recent memory, and it was an unpredictable moment that evolved into a story boss battle with this amazing track behind it. The tribal pumping rhythm propels the fight up to epic levels, and a mix of acoustic and electronic sounds in this track is a good example of what Automata's soundtrack does best. If this cannot continue was the moment Automata clicked with me, the amusement park theme was the moment I fell in love with its music. The amusement park theme encapsulates the creepy yet magical aesthetic of the amusement park with matching musical magic, with tight and quick guitars and slow piano put together with glockenspills and beautiful vocals. Together, they make a piece of music that has the perfect eerie vibe for this area, complete with a pop song structure that makes it addictive to listen to. The pieces in Automata are either creating suspense or a thumping action vibe, but the piece Rays of Light manages to be a pretty little exploration track while still featuring the musical elements carried throughout other tracks. Rays of Light may swap a lot of the strings and big percussion for guitars and pretty piano to create a softer feeling, but the piece is much like a song, with the vocals creating the emotiveness that Nier's other tracks have. It manages to be a great fit for running through one of the main areas of Automata and is unintrusive while still creating the unique atmosphere Nia has. Rays of Light is also one of my favorite tracks from the hacking versions of Nia's soundtrack, and the 8-bit version really helped the track grow on me. The simplicity of the 8-bit track brings out the melody in a new way, and it's always interesting to hear a natural sounding track redone digitally. The existence of Automata's hacking OST is much like the multifaceted nature of Automata, and has a majority of its tracks redone in cool 8-bit form as a new way to listen to it. I've talked before about how Nier Automata's trailers were a big part of what sold me on it, and this includes one of the early trailer fights featuring 2B and 9S fighting a robot wearing a red dress. The piece of beautiful song makes the battle shown in that trailer so much more intense, and the track matches the depth of the moment well with its big vocal driven track with tension raising drums. It's not every game that you can verse a robot in an opera gown with music this epic and cool, and a beautiful song is definitely up there in Automata's best boss battle pieces. I left Pascal's Village for last as it's the perfect combination of most of the things I love about Nier's soundtrack. Pascal's Village is one of the quirky and Nier tracks with a mix of childish vocals and electronic ones in lead lines and harmonies. And while spoilers are tough to avoid for this track, let's just say it sounds very fitting for its moment in the story. Pascal's Village's beautiful guitar and light percussion with these vocals helped make the eccentric track one of the most charming tracks from Automata, and contrasted with the epic boss battle music shows Keiichi Okabe's blend and range of styles very well. Thank you for watching my video, let me know what your favorite track from Nier Automata was, and let me know your favorite JRPG soundtracks as well. You can like this video if you enjoyed it, subscribe for more JRPG content from me, and check out the blog for more stuff too at jrpgjungle.blogspot.com. I'm also on social media, on Twitter, Facebook, and Instagram, all at jrpgjungle. And special thanks again to Comedifer or Dennis, this time for the cool new logo and designs featured here and on the blog. Go check them out and check out more of his works at his site as well. Until next time, thank you everyone, bye!